All right, everybody, Coach Jorge Capistana here with our fourth video in the series of five of what we do exactly each day at the Hope College Tennis Academy. So Thursday is the day we're going to talk about today, and Thursday has a theme of core drills. So think about the week in terms of five days. This is the fourth day. The kids now got to know each other. Even the kids who are new this week are kind of becoming friendly with some of the people they're hanging out with. And we just do a lot of what we call core drills or our favorite drills that the kids uh, always ask for. So one of the drills I want you to take a peek at here is called triples. And triples is a classic game to teach transition volleys. It's really fun. You rotate up and down as a team. So I'm going to show you here how it looks like. Uh, this team of one, two, three are one team, and they're playing this other team of four, five, and six. And it's basically a, a doubles point without the serve. So what happens is player one feeds the ball across court and then has to come into the net. And then the point is played out. And then the rotation is quite simple. Just one spot to the right, this guy goes here, and the next guy comes in. The same rotation happens on this side where they just kind of play one quick point and then they rotate out. So what I love about this drill is besides getting transition volleys, which is the, the focus of this drill, they get to play with friends, they're, they're keeping score, it's live ball, there's not a lot of like just dead ball feeding which can sometimes be fake and not help you as much. Uh, halfway through this game they'll switch ends and you're going to see that in a minute and then uh, they just keep score and they rotate up and down the courts. A lot of times we'll emphasize uh, the other position which is the return of serve. So let's go ahead and take a peek here at what triples looks like on the court. Okay, so this is a Thursday drill. It's core drill day, one of the favorite uh, days for the kids. One of our favorite drills is triples. I'll show you how it goes. It was invented to help the transition volley, particularly in doubles. All right, players, let's do it. So I'm gonna stay over here and park myself by um, Danny. And you'll see the feeder is gonna feed it, not, not a serve, because it takes too long, and then they're gonna run in. Whoa, well, play it out. And then they just do quick rotations to the left. So they're a team of three playing another team of three. Good. So you saw Donut had a transition volley there. That's it. Okay, here comes Danny. Feed from behind the line. That's super important. That's a transition volley. It was a higher, easier volley, or volley, but it was a transition volley. Nice. That's a lower one. That's it, guys. So that's key number one of this drill. We're trying to get lots of reps coming in behind it. This will simulate a person serving and volleying in singles or particularly in doubles. So go ahead and play this out. We'll play for time. Halfway through the game, we'll switch so that both sides get to rush in and both sides get to return. And then I'm going to show you a little bit about what this game is supposed to teach on this side. This is the side that simulates the return of serve. That was a great return, Kelly. So what we want here is a return that's super low. So here's what we find, and I'm going to step in here for just one second and do a timeout. When you're on this side and you're hitting the return of serve, it's very, really easy to kind of miss the mark. They're trying to do something that's not even effective. For, for example, a lot of times a player will judge this, his return by two things. I hit it hard and it went in. And if he answers yes to both those, he thinks, well, that's a great return. But it really isn't. The best attribute of return of serve is lowness. So if I have a, a halfway decent player like I, I do here today, and I hit a really hard return, and it makes them volley here, that's kind of a failure. I didn't really do a good job as a returner. Okay? So that's what we're working on here, guys. Dipping it low, and let's be really smart about it. I don't care if you got a lot of endorphins because you hit it hard. I want to see you win. All right, so there you have triples. That's the game that we play on Thursday amongst five or six other ones. Now, let me just kind of tell you a little bit about what we do in the afternoons, because I haven't done that yet. So on Monday afternoons, you know the theme from the first video, we do two hours of match play. This is where we go do nothing but match play and a supervised match play. Tuesday afternoons, we do one hour of match play with one hour off court, which could either be strength training or uh, tennis specific agility. Wednesday in the afternoon, we're back to two hours of match play. Thursday, again, one hour of match play, one hour off court. And Thursday, or Friday, which is the drill you're going to see next, is nothing but match play. We just kind of set up a tournament, right? So that's a little bit about what we do. I hope that gives you some insight on what we do here at the Hope College Tennis Academy on Thursday's theme.